Hello students. Welcome to the class. Today we are here with an another interesting poem of class 3. As you can see, the title of the poem is Bird Talk. This is written by Alan Fisher and this is a very interesting poem. But before starting learning the poem, I have something special for you. Let's see. So, now when you have listened the clip, tell me what do you hear? Yes, we hear the sounds of many birds. Students, we see many birds in our surroundings. We hear their sounds also. But as we don't know the language of the birds, we don't get what exactly they talk about. Kids, like we people talk about birds, we wonder about their habit, their nature. Is it possible they also talk about us? Yes, it is possible. This poem is exactly about this topic. In this poem, two words are talking with each other. Let's read what are they talking. Bird talk. Think said the robin. Think said the jay. Sitting in the garden, talking one day. Think about people, the way they grow. They don't have feathers at all, you know. They don't eat beetles. They don't grow wings. They don't like sitting on wires and things. Think, said the robin. Think, said the jay. Aren't people funny to be that way? Wow, what an interesting poem. Let's sing out this poem. Think, said the robin, think, said the jay, sitting in the garden, talking one day. Think, said the robin, think, said the jay, sitting in the garden, talking one day. Think, think, think. Think about people, the way they grow. They don't have feathers at all, you know. Think about people, the way they grow. They don't have feathers at all, you know. Think, think, think. They don't eat beetles, they don't grow wings. They don't like sitting on wires and things. They don't eat beetles, they don't grow wings. They don't like sitting on wires and things. Think, think, think. Think, said the robin. Think, said the jay. Aren't people funny to be that way? Think, said the robin. Think, said the jay. Aren't people funny to be that way? Students, do you like the poem? Yes? Now it is the time to explain the poem. Let's read the poem. Let's read the lines of the poem one by one. Let's start it. Think said the robin. Think said the jay. Sitting in the garden, talking one day. In this poem, there were two birds. The name of one bird is robin. And the name of other one is J. One day they were sitting in the garden and they were talking to each other. What were they talking? Think said the robin. It means robin said J to think. Think said the J. It means Jay also said, think means the two birds 
said thing to each other it means one day there were two birds robin and jay they were sitting in the garden and talking with each other they said each other to think but what to think let's read in the next lines think about people the way they grow they don't have feathers at all you know in these lines they were talking about people they were talking about human beings now you get what robin said j to think about robin said j to think about people and j said robin to think about people but what were they thinking about people what were they thinking about human beings the way they grow actually the birds grow in a different way than human beings grow as you can see in this images this is a journey of a man from kid to an adult and this is the journey of a bird the journey of the bird starts within an egg but human beings don't lay egg they give birds to babies so robin and jay were amazed the way the people grow they don't have feathers at all you know and they were amazed also that people don't have feathers birds have feathers but people don't have feathers at initial stages birds also don't have feathers but when when they grow up they get feathers but human beings people don't get feathers at any stage so they were amazed the way the people grow and they were amazed to think that people don't have feathers Let's read the next lines of this poem. Let's start it. They don't eat beetles. They don't grow wings. They don't like sitting on wires and things. In these lines, Robin and Jay said that the people don't eat beetles. Beetle is a kind of an insect. and birds love eating beetles but we people we human beings don't eat beetles we eat different things so robin and jay were amazed to see that people don't eat beetles they don't grow wings actually we see birds have wings and with the help of wings birds fly but we people don't have wings so we can't fly we need to walk on foot to go somewhere but birds fly to go somewhere so the birds were amazed to think that people don't grow wings they don't have wings let's read the next lines they don't like sitting on wires and things they don't like sitting on wires and things we see many birds sitting on wires in this image you can see also these birds are sitting on wire birds love sitting on wires and things but we human being don't sit on wire so they were amazed to think about people they were amazed to think that people don't eat beetles they were amazed that people don't grow wings they don't have wings they were amazed that people don't like sitting on wires and things they don't sit on wires and things so they were getting amazed in these lines let's read the next lines and find what they said next let's read things 
said the robin. Think, said the jay. Aren't people funny to be that way? It means once again robin said jay to think and jay said robin to think. They said each other to think. They said aren't people funny to be that way? They called people funny and they laughed. Like in this image you can see the bird is laughing and here also this bird is laughing. Actually, when we see something which is different to us, we call it funny and we laugh on it. Here, the lifestyle of birds and human beings are completely different. The birds have wings, people don't have wings. The birds have feathers. We people don't have feathers. The birds eat beetles, but we people don't eat beetles. The birds sit on wires, we people don't sit on wires. So we can see the life of birds and human beings are totally different. So when the birds see people, they call them fun. That is our poem. Let's read it once again. Think said the robin, think said the jay, sitting in the garden, talking one day. One day there were two birds, robin and jay, sitting in the garden and they were talking to each other. They said each other to think. Think about people, the way they grow, they don't have feathers at all you know. They were thinking about people. They were getting amazed that people don't have feathers and they were amazed the way the people grow. They don't eat, eat beetles. They don't grow wings. They don't like sitting on wires and things. In these lines, they were getting amazed on that people don't eat beetles and people don't have wings. They don't even like sitting on wires and think. Think said the robin, think said the jay, aren't people funny to be that way? In these lines of the poem, robin said jay to think and jay said robin to think. Aren't people funny to be that way? By saying this, they called people funny and they laughed on it. So this is our poem. So now let's go to the new words of this poem and let's learn the new words of this poem. Let's get started. Here is our first word beetles. B E E T L E S. We pronounce it beetles. Let's repeat B E E T L E S. Beetles. In this poem, we have read that birds love eating beetles. But do you know? What is the meaning of beetle? What we call beetles? Let's find out. Beetle is a name of an insect. Yes, beetle is an insect. It is a name of an insect. Let me show you what we call beetle. This is an image of beetle. This is a beetle. Birds love eating beetles. This is a type of an insect. So beetle is name of an insect. Let's try to make a sentence with the word beetles. I show beetles in the garden. I show beetles in the garden. Now let's move to the next word. The next word is sitting. S-I-T-T-I-N-G. Sitting. 
S I T T I N G city Students do you know what is the meaning of this word city We use this word often but what is the meaning of this word Let's check Sitting means to be in a particular position Sitting is actually a particular position like We can see here this baby is sitting on sofa this position is called sitting Now let's see its use in a sentence I was sitting in the room I was sitting in the room We have read that sitting means to be in a particular position Now let's move to the next word Here it is our next word it is wires w i r e s wires we pronounce it wires let's repeat w i r e s wires students we have read in the poem that birds love sitting on wires but what is the meaning of wires let's see wires mean thin flexible rod a rod that is flexible and thin we call it wires students have you seen wires let me show one image of wire this is a wire this rod which is very thin and flexible also this is what we call wire Let's try to make a sentence with this word wires. The birds sit on wires. The birds sit on wires. Wires means a thin flexible rod. Now let's check the next word. Here it is. S U N N Y funny F U N N Y funny We often use this word funny but what is the meaning of this word funny Let's check Funny means causing laughter Funny means causing laughter anything that causes laughter to us we call it funny Let's see an example. Robin and Jay call people funny. In the poem Robin and Jay call people funny. They call people funny it means people cause laughter to them. So people are funny to them. So there are these words we have learned in this poem. Thanks for watching the video. Thank you and have a nice day.